this week's video. But Cammy, where's your face? You may ask. Well, my face is gone because welcome to the world of digital art. <laughs> Today, I'm going to be digitally drawing my background for my phone and my PC. Anyways, let's get started. This is my home screen, and I'm making it a nice mint. All the way down, there's this crusty little bear that I drew. Scratch that. We're starting on this little head of a creature. This is Sweet Pea. He is one of my 196 stuffies. <gasps> Do a spin for me, yeah, very nice. Good job. Whopper, 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 junior, double, triple, whopper. And yeah, um, let's just not talk about that. So now I'm just drawing his body, and as you can see, I made his arms kind of long, but here's his feet, and this is where it gets kind of weird. So I added a bucket, then I had to fix up the lines and everything, then I had to add another line, which was really weird. And yeah, this is where I stopped. Okay. And I kept finishing on with the line, which was kind of weird to do because I had to guess where to put the lines. Okay. Once I finished, I got rid of the main color and started to fix up his head because it looked weird. And now I'm just drawing his little horns and his wings. I had to fix up the head again because it still looked really weird. And that looks way better. I added the eyes, the nostrils, and then I started coloring with the color that he is. And as you can see, the color I drew him with is quite darker than the actual stuffy, but spoiler alert, I do change that later. So then I did the horns and the wings. Okay, now it's time to add some texture. So I added like little whitish hairs all over him and it kind of looks like he's an old man. Oh. I've never seen a diamond in the flesh. I cut my teeth on wedding rings in the movies and I'm not proud of my dress. In the torn up town, no postcode envy. But every song's like old teeth, gray goes dripping in the bathroom, blood stains, ball gowns, stretching the hotel from we don't care. Then I just added some shadows because now I am adding some little stitches to make it look really like cute and like an actual stuffy, if you know what I mean. And then I added these little termites. I mean, little spots. <laughs> Autocorrect. Darker and lighter onto the wings and horns because if you see the actual design, he does have like that kind of texture on it. Then I added the shadows. It's probably one of my favorite parts and it's super satisfying when it's in time lapse. <sighs> Sorry, I just wanted to give a moment to appreciate the highlights. Now get ready for the background dilemma. I just decided that I should go with the original background color because I like it way better. Oh yeah, and I added the same stars. I put this glowy aura around Sweet Pea because I really wanted it to have like a very nice soft design. And here's the finished product on my lock screen and my home screen. Anyways, that's all for this week and I really hope you enjoyed my video. Bye. Wait. Does that say four minutes? Oh no, 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 we can't be done yet. Silly child, we're only on phase two of my evil plan. You forgot about my PC, didn't you? That's what I thought. Now go sit in the corner and think about what you've done. So I started with my favorite color, aka Periwinkle, and I started sketching this little crusty mouse and these two plants until I realized that doesn't really describe me. So starting off with a clean slate, I started drawing this little cereal bowl because I want to incorporate my only two things I've created that has been shown on my YouTube channel. Okay, pop quiz. If you were paying attention last week, you would know 
know who these two are. Did you guess marshmallow and strawberry? Well, good job, because that's wrong. If you said seed and s'mores, then you're right. Stay tuned for next week's pop quiz. Okay, so if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm making s'mores pour a bowl of pink cereal into a bowl, of course, with seeds, pink milk, because she's sitting on pink milk. Do you, do you get it? Okay, so as you can see, the head looks nothing like s'mores. So I just brought up this image of s'mores. So here's the thing. I may have traced it, but since I actually drew his face, it doesn't count. Because with the wisdomful words of this guy, if it's cheating, I get a beating. And guess what? I'm fine. <laughs> Then I changed his expression to give him a little like, eh, kind of like he's thinking about something. What you thinking about, bud? And I started on seed and she was actually surprisingly tricky. And what I went for is that she was um, holding on to the milk carton and then she accidentally let go of it. So this is moments from disaster. And I drew her little intricate bow and her arms and legs were tricky, but I eventually made them look better. Then I started on the milk jug. It was kind of weird because if you look at the design, there's a bunch of drips on it. And I decided to name the cereal Happy Peas. You get it for like pink. And then I made it a translucent layer and started tracing over the lines. And I had to make s'mores like skinnier because for some reason he looked really fat. Here's your ASMR segment. Okay, so now's the time to break it to you. I actually won't be able to finish the second drawing in this video, so there is gonna be another part, so stay tuned for part two, and I really hope you enjoyed this video, and bye, see you next week. Oh.